All full up. Can't carry any more. I can use these to climb out of here.
jump. There's no other way. I caught a fish once at home, in the well. Papa says it's because there are tunnels filled with water under some houses. Funny, huh? <sighs> do you believe that major events in life can be traced back to a single moment? I do. Take what's happening now. Had Amaru and Saidi not fought that day during the famine? And had Saidi not insisted, despite Amaru's wishes, that it should be him who would go beyond the safety of the borders to hunt for the village, perhaps things would be different today. You see, Amaru felt responsible for his brother's death. I heard him the night they pulled Sairi's body from the wilderness. He was beside himself with grief. I think that was the moment. It broke Amaru. He took complete control of Paititi after that. He wanted to protect us all, because he couldn't protect Saidi. Thanks again, Ishiki. I'm happy to have my dice back. On my way.
provide support. Do you have it? It was a trap. The box was taken and... Unaratu was captured. We heard. We're working on a plan. She's being held at the prison by the old temple. Akan led a raid and was taken too. We'll charge the bridge that leads to the prison. It's aggressive. What if I climb up here, free her, and then signal to attack? That could work. Let's leave scouting the temple in the upper district. He could find you a way in. I'll go talk to him. We'll have backup ready once you get her out. Sounds good. For strength and safety. Thank you. Laura. I'll get her out. Have more rebels been captured? Ishiki, maybe you can help. I sent five men to steal the cult of Kukulkan's weapons for the rebellion, but the mission failed. In former times, I would have led them myself, but now I can't fight. I can't even run, or else I start to cough up blood. But I'm still a good planner, or I was until today. My comrades were caught and strung on posts throughout the lower village as a warning. They're going to hang there until they die. You said I might be able to help? Yes. With your Serpent Guard attire, you can untie all four of them and no one will suspect you. Four? You said there were five men on the mission. There were. Kolki was leading them, but he wasn't captured along with the others. Nobody's seen him. He's probably been killed. I'll see what I can do. Mm, impossible. I can't carry any more. to finally kill me. I'm not with the cult. I'm a friend here to free you. That's an effective disguise. Can you use it to free the others and find Kolkui? I hope so, but I don't know what happened to him. He's alive. Kolkui's alive. In the confusion, I heard him shout, ordering a retreat. I'm sure he's alive. I'm 
not see me beg. You're wasting your time. I'll never tell you anything. I'm not here to interrogate you. I'm here to free you. Bribery? Life as a traitor would be worse than death. I'm sure it would, but I'm a friend. Thank you, friend. You're welcome. You and your friends are safe. No. The cult was expecting us. A spy has infiltrated the rebellion. Spirit? No, I'm very much alive, as are you. <laughs> a mortal and an immortal. There, you're free to go. Yes, I have been liberated. This is what we deserve for failing so miserably. Don't be so rough on yourself. You'll live to fight another day. We didn't fight. We gave up when we were surrounded. Marched off to die without a single drop of blood on the ground. I freed your friends, and there's more good news. Kolkwi is alive. He was in the lead when the others were surrounded. He shouted a warning and ran away. That's excellent. There is one concern. You may have a traitor in the rebellion. I know we do. I learned who he was while you were gone, and I'm going to personally see he gets what he deserves. All right. Here, take this as a thank you. I appreciate all your help. If you're right about Kolkwi, he would have gone to the mountain safe house. Can you go find him, please? Let him know we have retreated to Skull Cave. I'll find him.
Kalki! Kalki! Kalki came while you were freeing the others. We didn't know he was a Jaguar warrior. He offered me payment. How could I refuse? You should have, Boma. Kukulkan hates outsiders and traitors. No! It's about what death to the one who defies Kukulkan. There! The outsider Kukulkan sent us more. Kukulkan Kalakabon! Anda! Kabunim Puhani! Kukakile Kimen! Chaikotzilil Kukulkan.
Hi, Justin Wolf. Shanka, she catch. Catch she clean. Impossible. I can't carry any more. Father, father, come quick. It's the Ishiki. What do you want? We don't have time for Unuratu's rebellion right now. Are you Kabil? Uchu sent me for the king's... The king's horn? The call to the future? <laughs> Look at the good that future's done for my present. Just go. The cult found out my dad was making the horn. They poisoned our crops as punishment. Mom got sick. My brother Kuali went to the market to get herbs, but he hasn't returned. That's terrible. Let me see if I can find your brother and get the herbs you need. Thank you. Me. Ah, Ishiki. How can I help you? I'm looking for Kuali, the son of Kabil. Oh, that poor boy. Chimali, one of Kukulkan's thugs, is holding him in a cell up at the market, waiting for the Ahau to come to punish him. Thank you. Be well, Ishiki. All full up. Can't carry any more. A herb thief. He must be very dangerous. Today it's theft, and tomorrow it's murder. That's quite a leap, don't you think? You really want to know what I think? I think we should round up all these little rats and drown them. Every one of them. Especially Yumil. His father may be a serpent guard, but he is not. Hello there. Hey, you're Ishiki. From the outside, right? Yes, it's nice to meet you. Well, it's me. I'm Yamil. <laughs> what sort of game are you boys playing? It's not a game. My father is a serpent guard, a priest. I took his ceremonial knife to show my friends, and Shimali the guard saw. Shimali knows what father would do if he found out I took the knife, so he threw it up there. Now it's stuck. Oh, let me see what I can do. Wow, really? Thank you. Thank you, Ishiki. You're welcome. Hey, wait a minute. The grown-ups around here always chase us away. But you helped. What do you want? Shh, I'll do the talking. So what do you want, Ishiki? I mean, is there something we can do to pay you back? I'm trying to help Kuali. You're too late. He's been sentenced to death. We can't do anything. And Chimali the guard hates you. Would Chimali chase you if you provoked him? Why? 
Because if he's not at his post, I can get to Kuali. Yeah, I like it. Oh, you can tell Kuali to meet us at the cave. He'll know where it is. It'll be safe for him there. I will. Let's go. Asto, Raimi, with me. Samin, watch our backs. Then run to the cave. Stand back, Ishiki. We'll give you an opening. Shimali, you coward! You'll end your life as a slave! Come taste my blade! <laughs> yeah, and taste llama patties too! Run, run! Jay, what's your name? Little thief should be punished. Please, they were just herbs. I beg you, a word. Your brother told me of your troubles. Wait, who are you? Someone who wants to help. I never wanted any of these to happen. I was only trying to help my mother get well. Where are the herbs? Give them to me. I will heal your mother. Go. Your friends are waiting for you at the cave. Thank you. Here are the herbs. I'll run as fast as I can. I told you to go. Kuali is safe, and I have the herbs your wife needs. Really? And did you come to cure her, or to barter for the king's horn? Here. This will help you. Bless you, Ishiki. Kabil, quit being an ass. Give her the horn. <sighs> Here. With respect to the future king. Thank you for all you've done. Thank you. Last to leave and first to return. Jonah's stories of you are true. The King's Horn, as requested. Did Kabil give you any trouble? You were right about his wife. She definitely had a way with his heart. Thank you for this, Lara. Of course. Uchu, what did you mean, last to leave and first to return? The men I have retrieving the other two items, they both left three days ago. Neither has returned. Do you think something's happened to them? It's Quentin that concerns me the most. He's young, likes to take risks. Jumps into the water before checking to see how deep it is. I know the type. Jonah. Jonah's right. That describes Quenty perfectly. I never should have sent Quenty to that damn place. Mm, what place is that? The old cistern. It's where the remains of Manko are kept hidden from the cult. Who is Manko? He was a farmer who led Sairi and Amaru's ancestors out of Cusco to safety centuries ago. He is known as the peasant savior. It's his amulet we need for the coronation. Why was Manko hidden away? Manko's followers were known as the Order of the Peasant Savior. This rebellion was born from it. When the cult of Kukulkan first took power, they tried to wipe out the Order. Manko was hidden away in a secret place and kept safe. But over time, as the Order dwindled, the memory of that place has faded. If you like, I could go look for Quenti. You've done a lot already. Bringing back the King's Horn was a big gesture of friendship. I don't mind, really. Maybe Quenty can show me the best cliffs to jump off. Please don't encourage him. The entrance to the cistern is a cave above the white tree. Follow the trail, it'll lead you to it.
What are you doing? I'm trying to read this stupid mural. I will. Show respect. I'm sorry, Ahau. I mean no disrespect to Kukulkan. I'm studying the murals to become a serpent guard, like my father. I'm sure he's very proud of you. But what if I can't understand the lessons they're teaching? Then what? Maybe I can help. Do you think your father would mind that? Would he, Mayu? No, child. I'm sure your father would be pleased to learn you've had the Ahau's help. Great. I've got part of this first one here. It's water. Well, something about water anyway, uh, I think. And the others I haven't looked at yet. How about I go and study all the murals and then come back to you and we can discuss them? I'll be here. I'm Lara, by the way. I will. Uchu said the entrance to the cistern was a cave above the white tree. There's the entrance. No one's been through here in centuries. This has to be the right place.
Manco's resting place. This looks suspicious. This looks like a procession of the dead. It's the order hiding Manco from the cult of Kukul Khan. This shows burial dolls, pottery, and textiles being placed in here with the dead. This wasn't just a hiding place. The Order turned it into a crypt. The Order left members behind as sentinels when they sealed the system. All these bones, they sacrificed themselves to protect this place. Hello, Manko. Now, where's the amulet? Now, to get this back to Uchu. 
There's light coming through this wall. Another sealed off passageway, I bet. So proud. is now below the fed become the food that sow the ground the earth Amun, the corn god within him like a bird, but do not breathe. Water? So him must be Chuck, the god of rain. He erases the dark and brings the day that follows. That's the sun. Kenichahau is the sun god. The gods in the murals are all giving life and taking it away. A balanced interaction. The murals were teaching about the duality of life and death. Heavy stuff for a child. Thank <laughs> you. 
catch him at an edge. Mayu. Where's the other came and collected her? He said he wanted to reward her for her studies and let her participate in a ritual. What ritual? The ritual of awakening. A how? That involves the sacrifice of a child. Do you think a wheel's father would harm her? I've known him for years. Today, when he came, he looked right through me. His eyes were black, empty. Where did he take her? To the abandoned village. Please, hurry.